I'm Brittany. I'm here with Tim at Peterborough Iron and Metal. He's going to explain to me different grades of copper content. Okay, Brittany, today we're going to look at uh, some of the different grades of uh, copper content material. There's all kinds of different grades. Uh, today I'm just going to show you the main grades that come in through the door. Perfect. Okay, so starting off first, this is what we call electric motors. Electric so, motors. Uh, as you can see here, this is copper, okay? Yeah, well, there's a lot. And then there's steel as well, right? So this is something that gets bought as an electric motor and sold as an electric motor. Um, stuff that uh, we're not going to take apart because it's just not feasible for us to take this apart to get the copper out. Oh, so okay. it gets sold the way it is, right? So that's electric motors, okay? okay? So then over here, this is similar to an electric motor. These are what called compressors. Compressor. Okay, so typically you find these in uh, aircon units. That's your usually where they come out of. Okay, so as you can see, there's copper here, and there's copper here. So inside this unit, there's a little electric motor, and what it does oh. is it pumps the freon gas through the through the radiators to, to make it cool, right? So you get your AC, right? Okay. So this is a, a sealed unit. So again, yes, it's an electric motor, but because it's a sealed unit, there's more steel. It's right. got to get sold separately, right? So that's compressors. Okay, so then uh, I just kind of threw these in the same box so that we don't have to reach in. This is a starter. Starter. Okay, so starters are in cars. Yeah. Okay, so this you starts your start car. car. Got to start the car, right? So again, there's copper in here, but this also has aluminum. So this casing is aluminum. Okay. Right. Okay. Yeah. So it's worth more than an electric motor or a compressor. Oh, it is. Yes, because there's aluminum on it. Right. Aluminum's worth more than steel. Right. Copper's worth more than aluminum. So you keep this stuff separate, you sell it separate, you get good money for it the way it is, right? Okay. Okay? So, yep, this is an alternator. Again, these come on vehicles, okay? So this you keep separate from everything as well because there's more aluminum and more copper. Okay, so you can see inside there there's copper. Oh yeah, wow, there's a lot of copper in there. That's right. There's a lot of aluminum. It's on both sides. That's right. And there's copper in the armature as well, it spins. So that thing. This thing will spin. It's not spinning so good. And that's probably why it's here, right? <laughs> so this is an alternator. So again, this is something we buy separate, we sell separate. Okay? okay. So that's that. And so that would cost the most out of all of the other pieces? Alternators are up there the most out of all the other pieces. This is worth the most. Then you got starter, then electric motor. My phone's in it's a custom. So we're just going to call him back in a minute. Beautiful. Okay, and then you got compressors as the least, right? Okay. Okay, so then uh, coming down over here in this box, I'm just going to have to reach in here for a second. These are transformers. Okay? Transformers. So again, there's copper. Yeah, all over okay. there, right? And then this steel, okay? This is, this is a good grade of steel. It's called silicon steel. Silicon steel. That's right. So it looks like it's one solid block, but if you yeah. look very close, Oh, there's all those lines. Right, so it's thin layers of steel. Really? That's just pressed together, right? That's so crazy. that's actually a high grade of steel if you have that by itself. Wow. Yeah, it's a really, really good grade of steel to sell if you get a lot of that. Okay, so that's a transformer. Okay. So again, copper, steel, something you keep separate, sell separate. So that's that. And then over in this box here, I'll just climb through here. There we go. This is what we call a copper aluminum rad end. So then this is all of the copper. That's right. And then over here is all the copper. Yep. And there's aluminum. Oh, this aluminum. this is aluminum. Okay, and this is steel. So this at one point was oh. part of a rad. Okay. Oh, really? A copper aluminum rad, yep. And the customers cut the end off because then they'll get paid clean for the right. copper aluminum rad. And then this is worth a separate price. So this is a copper content material. Believe it or not, something like that we're paying right now, I think 35, 40 cents a pound for. Really? Yeah, so it seems yeah. crazy for something with such a little amount of copper. Yeah. But you got to remember, clean copper is, uh, you know, the mid twos right now, 235, 240, right? Wow. So that's anything really with high. copper is going to be worth more. Oh my and gosh. And it's always that's worth a lot. saving. Yeah, it's uh, you never want to throw copper away, even if it's a small, small amount of copper, always worth keeping separate because really? it is always worth more than throwing it into your steel pot. So that's that. So that basically sums it up for uh, the copper content grades. There's a lot of grades that come in. Uh, you know, we could show you probably 50 more grades, but uh, that's the stuff that comes in every day, all the time, right? Every day. 
So, uh, well, thank you very much. No problem. Maybe next time we'll show you our hydraulic shear and we'll show you how we clean some of the copper and brasses. That'll be awesome. Perfect. Woo!